Hey, what is up guys? Welcome back to another Yu-Gi-Oh! unboxing. Today we are going to be opening up a first edition booster box of the most recent set, Secret Slayers. So let's crack right into this thing. Uh, some of the cards we're going to be looking for are the uh, Ad Emancipators. Uh, they're pretty much the best general thing you can get in this set. Um, looking for Elblitch the Golden Lord, Rika Glamour, uh, the other, the, what is it, Eldlixer, uh, Black Awakening. Um, let's see. I, I think those are the biggest ones. Damn shrink wrap. Oh my goodness. Sorry about that. Uh, th those are the biggest ones. So we're just going to get popping right into this set. And uh, really hope we get the Eldlixer. Or not the Eldlixer, uh, Eldritch. Uh, Golden Lord. So let's get right into this. Alrighty. Yeah, I believe it's Ad Emancipator uh, Researcher. It's one of the ones we're looking for. Alright, so let's see. Block Dragon, Ill Blood, Talia, Princess of Cherry Blossoms, Cursed Eldland, and Eldlixer of Scarlet Sanguine. So there's one of the first Eldlixers. Um, you know, like a, the highest value things are, like I said, the Eldlix, the Golden Lord, uh, what is this? Teardrop, the Rika Queen, I think. There's another one. Or it's Teardrop the Fairy Queen, something like that. Uh, so Doki Doki, DD Borderline, Ad Emancipator Raptite. Uh, gosh, I can't even read that. Chirubime, okay. And then Guardian of the Golden Land. So that goes with our elixir. Basically, the Guardian, or the Golden Land uh, traps are the monsters that go in the uh, zombie elixir deck or whatever. Um, and then the Elblixers are the spells and traps that uh, go with them. So Rose Lover, Miracle Fertilizer, God, that's been printed so much. Ad Emancipator, Lapitite, Upstart Goblin, that's a good super. And Elblixer of Black Awakening, I believe that is a very good secret rare to get. Set that off to the side there. I think that Upstart's pretty good to get too, so we'll set that off to the side. So, uh, not doing too bad so far. Cracking right into the next pack here. Chirubime again. Uh, there's the Ad Emancipator Crystal Raptite. Uni Zombie. Miracle Fertilizer again. And Ad Emancipator Relief. Alright. Man, I think some of these. I don't. One discussion I kind of want to have with you guys is the why has Miracle Fertilizer been reprinted so much? It's not that like valuable. It's actually the Rika Queen. Uh, Trap Trick, nice. Titanial. And uh, Ad Emancipator Risen Dragite. Okay. But Miracle Fertilizer's been reprinted so much. Like, it, it, it's not even close to being a valuable card in so many of its printings. I don't know why they decided to reprint it again in this set. Like, I get there's some of the plants in here, but like... Oh, Upstart Goblin, nice. That's good. We'll set that off to the side there. Uh, Kanzashi the Rika Queen, Trap Trick again, Titanium, and Ad Emancipator Analyzer. I don't believe that's the more valuable one, but uh, still goes with the Ad Emancipators, so we will take it. Oh, it's a different secret. So, right. keep on powering through this box here. Uh, trap Trick again, there's a place at Lone Fire Blossom again, Polynosis, and Mudan the Rika Fairy. Wow. Already a playset of Trap Trick. I don't remember if Trap Trick is, holds much value or not. I wanted to say it did, but I might be thinking of some other trap in here. So, um, Lone Fire Blossom again, Polynosis, DD Borderline, and Mudan the Rika Fairy. Nice. Two of the same secret in a row. <laughs> don't particularly care for the Rika cards. Um, it's not a deck I'm ever going to play. But, you know, we'll hold on to them, I guess. Marina, Princess of Sunflowers, Rika Tranquility, Trap Trick again, uh, Hellivore, the Rika Fairy, and Akero, Wakero of the Golden Land, something like that. Uh, so there's the second Golden Land monster. Wow, we have pulled so many freaking Trap Tricks. How? <laughs> it 
can't hold much value if I'm pulling this many of them, right? Um, wow. Okay. Quakimaru Overload, Cyclamen the Rika Fairy, Nine Tailed Fox, Uni Zombie, and another Hakaro of the Golden Land. Man, there are so many cards in this set, and we are already pulling duplicates. <laughs> I got, I'll got. i have another box opening of this on the way. I think I'm only going to do a couple of these. Uh, you know, it's a good set, but I don't particularly care for the archetypes in it that much. Um, aside from the Eldlick, uh, the Eldlick, uh, Eldlicks or whatever you want to call it, that zombie deck is pretty cool. Kwakimara Sandman and Adamancipator Seeker. Pretty cool. I think it's the Researcher, I believe, is the one that we want. Take from the bottom. I think that was in that. Oh, we'll see. Come on. There we go. All right. Dragon. Solemn Judgment. That's a good super to get. Uh, there's the Leonite Crystal and Eldlixir of White Destiny. That's pretty cool. We'll get one another one of those Eldlixir cards to go with that deck. Yeah, I, I'm actually all for all this zombie support they've been releasing recently. It's pretty awesome, actually. Uh, Upstar Goblin again. Wow, nice. Uh, Perennial, Ill Blood, and Ad Emancipator Arisen Leonite. Awesome. That is a great secret rare to get. I think it's uh, the third or fourth highest value one in the set. Something like that. But it's up there. So, I'll show you that art there. There we go. That's a great secret to get. Wouldn't mind getting another one of those. Uh, let's keep on moving through here. Let's see here. Galaxy Cyclone, Quakimara Sandman, Blood, and Primula, the Rika Fairy. I might just end up building this Rika deck, or at least the deck core, because I mean, I already have, uh, aside from the uh, teardrop, I will pretty much guarantee to have play sets of all the other uh, Rika cards, so, all right, Talia, Princess Cherry, Blossoms, Marina, Rika Tranquility, Trap Trick again, and Rika Sheet. Wow, another Trap Trick, huh? Pulling a lot of these, these supers are becoming super repetitive already. I feel like in the other um, sets like this, they weren't as repetitive, but... You know, maybe that was just my pull luck or whatever. Maybe I'm just unlucky this time. Cursed Eldland, nice. Um, and Guardian of Golden Land again. All right. Again, looking for the Adam Anticipator Researcher, Eldritch, the Golden Lord, another Upstar, wow. Yeah, I think these supers, are there not as many supers in this set? I don't actually know. El Dorado Adelantado. Um, I don't actually know what that does. <laughs> That's, uh, I don't remember which part of the deck that plays into. I'll have to look into that later. Um, but Adam Peter Researcher, Eldrick the Golden Lord, Teardrop, the Rika Queen, and uh, Rika Glamour, Leonite. Oh, another Solemn Judgment. Nice. Awesome. I can always use more of those. Uh, Guardian, and Adam Peter Seeker. Alrighty, getting more of those Adam Emancipators. Um, only dragon we've pulled, the only uh, synchro and emancipator we've pulled so far is the dragite. Uh, I guess the leonite too, uh, but we're still missing one, I believe. There's dragite crystal, upstart coffin again. Wow, wow. Uh, Rika flurries. Okay. All right. Um. Yeah. Uh. Feeling happen. Oh, another sullen judgment. Okay, cool. Take it. Uh, Reptite, ill blood, and teardrop the Rika Queen. There we go. That's a great secret to get in this set. That's fantastic. Beautiful art there. Um, yeah, that's awesome. Fantastic. We will gladly take that. More, definitely one of the better secrets in the set. So, um, moving right along here. Got four packs left, it looks like. Let's see if we can get one of those two big value cards. Probably not, but 
Um, you know, we're actually not doing too bad so far. So, Guardian of the Golden Land. There's our playset of the Guardian. Yeah, definitely not doing too bad here in this opening. And like I said, I got one other box still. I know that Eldritch is like one every four boxes again. So, uh, you know, hopefully we can see another trap trick. My goodness. Ad Emancipator Analyzer. Um, and I think the Researcher is like one every two or three, something like that. And Teardrop, I believe, is also a short print. There's quite a few short prints in this set, I believe. So it, it's a bit strange, but, um, you know, we can only hope to pull some of them. And we got the Teardrop, so that's pretty cool. Uh, let's see, Guardian Doki Doki and Ad Emancipator Relief. Getting a lot of these Ad Emancipator cards. <laughs> uh, last pack. Let's see. Let's hope we can get something epic. Um, I'm not going to keep my hopes up for it, but you never know. All right, Nine-Tailed Fox, Adam Antipater Signs, Pyramid of Wonders, Quacky Mare Sandman, and El Dorado Adelantado. All right, <laughs> so not the greatest box opening, uh, not the highest value, but we got some cool stuff. We got, you know, we got our Teardrop, we got the playset of Solemn Judgment, I believe, yeah. We got our playset of Solemn Judgment, uh, we got our Leonite, Got our, uh, where is it? Eldlixir, the Black Awakening. It's either the Black Awakening or the White Destiny that's exp that's valuable. I think it's the Black Awakening. And we got five upstart goblins. So, um, overall, not a terrible box. Could have been worse. Also could have been better. But, you know, can't be too disappointed. You take what you get. So, I uh, hope you enjoyed, guys. Uh, if you enjoyed, consider hitting that like button. Uh, subscribe for more content like this. Like I said, we got another box opening on the way here soon. And uh, thanks for watching. See ya.